Alright, now look. One of the most important things you guys remember wrestling is positioning. Wrestling is positioning. So, four parts to a takedown. Listen, four parts to a takedown. You set up, your penetration, transition, and then you finish. Okay? Transition gets forgotten about five. Okay, and that's where heat pounds come in. So you set up. If I got my wrestle blades are here, I gotta open them up some way. We talked a lot about that. First couple of sessions here. Pushing, pulling, pushing into him, making him lean into me. Right? So I get him lean in, and then I disappear. I hit my shot. Boom, oh, right here. Now. Okay. A lot of you guys wrestle big tournaments. You got, and you, one of the tough guys, big tournaments. Tough guys are gonna defend your shot. Okay, that's what they're gonna do. They're not just going to give you a single leg. They're not just gonna be able to come up with the leg. You want to, you're hoping to, but if he reacts quickly and he gets his leg back here, okay, I gotta get my knee over here, okay, closer to his foot. That's gonna enable my hips to get under me. I have to keep my hips under me, here. So there's your knee pound. Okay, now I'm in a better position to finish. My head is going up, okay. My hips are underneath me, okay? Lock the hand, okay? Back hand comes under, okay? And right up in, right up, okay? Once again, you're gonna need a knee pump. So I'm here, here, okay? Now, he takes that leg back, right here. Do not be a toony fish. We talked about this this morning, okay? As soon as I go to this knee right here, my back knee, I have now become a toony bitch. Okay? He's gonna stuff my head and make my finish a terrible time for me. Okay? So you have to make sure when we go back out, this guy, I hit my single leg. Okay? Here, set him up, shot, his leg goes back, knee pound right away, head goes up, knee pound. Okay? You have to be able to do that. Okay? Now, if you go head outside, because we're going to put it, we're going to do a sequence here. Right? It's going to be a sequence. If you go head outside. We were doing fireman's carries this morning, right? And so if I hit a fireman's carry and I come here, sometimes the guy pulls his arm out. Look what he's doing his leg. Okay? Look, look, right here. I'm pulling. You need to pull the leg for one. Right? You don't just shoot and just put your hand on his leg. You're gonna pull, but you're gonna knee pound closer. Okay? Knee pound, stay up into him, windshield wiper, right here. Man, I'm going up into him. See how I have him off balance? Okay? And it's gotta be right now, once again. You wanna be a 2 knee fish? Here's what's gonna happen. Okay? You're gonna shoot, he's gonna throw the leg back, you're gonna go to your second knee. Alright, now you're in a dog fight. He continues to get his leg back, I'm pushing my head down. Okay, he has the advantage. All right? So, how do we correct that? Well, there's a drill we can do. We're gonna start off here. Okay? You guys paying attention? We'll start off here at a high C. Okay? I'm just gonna yell knee pound. When I yell knee pound, he's going to take his leg back. Okay? I'm gonna knee pound here. Okay, then we're gonna go double, right? And I'll let you know. So we start going, knee pound. Double. Knee pound. See how he's moving? See how he's moving? Single. See how? Right here. See how? See how he's moving? Double. High C. Double. Finish. Okay? The whole time, one knee. One knee pushing off your back foot. Okay? Start here. Right? And I'll let you know. I'll yell, double leg, okay? And it's going to be quick. And I'm not going to have you guys knee pounding for like 20 seconds. It's going to be fairly quick. Okay? So once again, here, ready, knee pound. Double. Single. Double. Single. Finish. Okay? That time we finish to a single. Okay? So wherever you're at, when I yell finish, come up with it. You got that? Head up, back straight, hips in, stay into your guy. Okay? Head up, back straight, hips in, stay into your guy. Alright? One, two.